Hello guys, Marcio Barbosa here. Um, here tonight to talk about the East versus West coming up. Um, I'm gonna be doing some uh, short videos about the matches that got my attention. It's so many matches, it's like 15 matches, you know, super matches. And uh, I just did a video about Devon Larry against Prunic, which is the match that excites me the most, you know, in this card. And how not to talk about the GOAT, John Brzezink, the legend, the great of all time in our sport, and 58 years old. And he's gonna face in this East versus West um, a guy that is really, really, it's gonna be a really hard opponent for him, in my opinion. Oleg Petrenko is, um, I used to follow him when he used to, when he started showing um, his abilities. Um, he's a student of, of the great, rest in peace, uh, Andre Pushkar. And he's the, he got a great, it looks like he's got a great side pressure. Great hand, great wrist, super strong. I saw some videos in the past about Ole Petrenko. He seems very, very strong. He was part of the top eight, 95 kilos that never happened. Um, and um, he's just back in the scenes, you know. East versus West is a great opportunity to, you know, where the greats can collide, <laughs> you know. The old and the new, you know, John Brzezink, even at that age, 50, 58 years old, still trying to play with the elite, which is amazing to me. Um, Ole Petrenko, I'm not sure how old is him, maybe 24, 25 years old, something like that. His last appearance was, in, uh, was against Antonovics from Latvia. And uh, I heard he was not in the best shape. Um, he got his hand exposed in the last, in the late matches, like in the last one, last couple ones, if I'm not mistaken. So saying that, like, uh, that might be the key for John. I don't think power for power, he, should, he shouldn't go power for power against Petrenko. I think... Uh, John still have a great hand and wrist, so that's uh, that's the weapon against Petrenko, in my opinion. Petrenko's arm probably stronger, but John, but also Petrenko has a strong hand, but because he has so much muscle, uh, the most muscle you have, the most oxygen you need, like. The time for resting, it's always more for people who has more muscle. So it might be a big advantage for John in that in that scenario, but uh I don't know guys, it's gonna be a tough match. I want you guys I wanna know your opinion. I would it's hard to bet to bet against John Brzezink. I'm gonna in my opinion I think it's fifty fifty. I mean, like I said, Petrenko is stronger than John, but I'm hoping John's hand, you know, wrist, hand, he can complicate, he can burn, you know, Petrenko's finger, fingers in the in that match. I think it's that's that's his weapon against Petrenko is a his powerful hand and wrist. So I'm cheering for John. And I hope he wins. If I, if you ask me about prediction, I would say three, three to two, John Brzezink. Even though Petrenko to me, it's even at the same level as Ongarbayev, maybe even stronger than Ongarbayev, but just a different style. He's more like a side weight, you know. He's more like a side pressure guy. Uh, Ungarbayev, a more pronation guy, back pressure. So, 
that might help John a little bit. You know, even though, like I said, the trinkets to me is stronger. But I'm cheering for John. Let me know your opinion, guys. I think, like I said, 3 2. Um, I'm going with 3 2 John Brzezink. And I'll come back with more videos. Uh, I want to talk about Hermes versus Dave Chafee. It's going to be fun. Uh, like I said, let me know your opinion about the GOAT is in action again. John Brzezink versus Oleg Petrenko. Let me know your opinion. How you think this match is going to go. Alright guys, see you in the next video.